So this question asks us for the x-intercepts. In other words, what values of x are going to make y equal to 0? So you could plug in these numbers. 0 certainly works because this is all multiplication. Um, negative 9 because negative 9 plus 9 is 0. And then 3 because 3 minus 3 is 0. So this is our answer. Essentially, we're just setting each one of these factors equal to 0 and solving for x. Um, if you've got a graphing calculator, you could type this equation in. Um, so y equals x times x plus 9 times x minus 3. See for yourself, if I zoom out a little bit, we can see these x-intercepts. There's the neg negative 9, there's 0, and there is positive 3.